Unless you drive an electric or hydrogen-powered car, your car certainly has a gasoline or diesel engine under the bonnet. These engines generate power via internal combustion, which produces exhaust emissions, including small amounts of smoke. Different colors of smoke, usually black, blue, gray, or white, can appear from an exhaust from time to time. But not all of these are necessarily a cause for alarm. An occasional puff of smoke from the exhaust during acceleration is usually nothing to worry about. But generally, in most modern vehicles with well-maintained engines and exhaust systems, you shouldn't see any visible smoke coming from the exhaust pipe. If you do, that's usually a sign that something's wrong with the engine. Visible smoke is almost always an indication of a problem, but here's the silver lining. The color of the smoke can actually help you figure out what's going wrong. Different issues tend to produce different colored smoke, so it can give you a clue about what to look into. So in this video, let's take a look at the different types of exhaust smoke and understand what they indicate about your vehicle's condition. White smoke. If you've noticed white smoke coming from your car's exhaust, you might be wondering if it's something to be concerned about. In many cases, it's completely normal. However, if the white smoke continues or is excessive, it could indicate a more serious issue. Let's break it down so you know what to look for. White smoke can occur during normal operation when starting a cold engine, as it is often just water vapor or steam caused by condensation in the exhaust system. As long as the smoke is thin, this is completely normal and should disappear after a few minutes of running the engine. When your car is parked outside, especially overnight, condensation can build up inside of the exhaust system. Starting your car will warm that condensation, turning it into steam. As the exhaust system warms up, the condensation will disappear and the white steam along with it. If you drive a hybrid, especially a plug-in hybrid, you're likely to also see white smoke or condensation coming from the exhaust pipe. This is because hybrid cars don't always fire up the engine straight away, which means you might not see steam immediately when you start driving. Depending on how much battery range you drive on, you could see steam from your exhaust well into your journey. But this, again, is nothing to worry about. It's just a delayed reaction to the same heating process. However, in IC engines, if you notice white smoke that doesn't go away after the engine has warmed up, it could be a sign of a more serious issue. Excessive white smoke usually means coolant is getting into the combustion chambers of your vehicle. This often happens due to a cracked or leaking head gasket, which allows coolant to seep into the cylinders. If you see this, you'll want to get it checked out as soon as possible to avoid further damage. If you also notice a sweet smell coming from the exhaust, that's a pretty clear sign the coolant is being burned off, which usually means you're dealing with a head gasket problem. At the first sign of white smoke, you should consider using a head gasket repair treatment to seal the leak before causing serious damage to your engine. Blue smoke. If you see blue smoke from your car's exhaust, it typically indicates that oil is being burned in the engine. Engine oil is designed to lubricate moving parts, and it does not enter the combustion chamber. However, if there's an issue, oil can leak into the combustion chamber and burn along with the air-fuel mixture, which results in blue smoke coming from the exhaust. Another reason might be that if your car has been serviced recently, or you've serviced it yourself, it could be that too much oil has been put back into the system, and this excess oil is burning off. If the smoke stops after a while, then there's no problem. Or if your car is old or has covered a large number of miles, it's pretty common for engine seals to wear and allow oil to leak into the combustion chamber. This usually happens because of damaged cylinder walls, piston rings, or valve seals. This wear can lead to oil leaking into the combustion chamber, where it mixes with air and fuel, resulting in blue smoke during combustion. If you're seeing blue smoke from a turbocharged car, then another reason for it could be a worn-out turbocharger. This will need rebuilding or replacing, which is also an expensive job. Alongside blue smoke, drivers may notice other symptoms that may indicate oil burning, such as loss of power, rough idling, and increased oil consumption. If you're experiencing any of these issues, it is advisable to have a qualified mechanic perform a thorough inspection to determine the best course of action. To avoid these issues, 
Always ensure you're using the right oil for your car and keep up with regular maintenance. If you're unsure about the right type of oil or how often to change it, don't worry, I've got you covered. I have a video that explains everything you need to know about oil changes and choosing the right oil for your vehicle. You can check it out right here. It's an easy guide that will help you keep your car running smoothly and prevent costly repairs down the road. Black smoke. We commonly see black smoke coming out from cars on the road. It is usually the carbon being emitted. However, like the other types, there are also different causes of black smoke. And one of the main factors to take into account is whether your car is gasoline or diesel powered. Black smoke in a gasoline car typically indicates that too much fuel is being burned relative to the amount of air available for combustion. This is often a sign that the air fuel mixture is too rich. It means that the fuel injectors are either adding too much fuel or the intake valves aren't getting enough air in, and this eventually causes your fuel to get consumed too quickly. Black smoke is rare at idle but very common under heavy load, and it can affect both diesel and gasoline engines, and unfortunately most diesel engines have a higher rate. Another possible cause is bad air filter. A clogged or dirty air filter can restrict the amount of air entering the engine. This restriction causes the engine to burn more fuel to maintain power, leading to the production of black smoke due to incomplete combustion. Also, a bad MAF sensor and oxygen sensor can both contribute to a vehicle emitting black smoke from the exhaust. Black smoke in a diesel car is often caused by soot buildup or by the diesel particulate filter regenerating. Diesel engines produce more soot as a byproduct of combustion compared to petrol engines. If the combustion process isn't fully efficient, it can cause excess soot, which results in black smoke. The DPF is designed to filter and trap soot and particulate matter from diesel exhaust. If the DPF becomes clogged with soot and is not able to clean itself, it can result in significant black smoke being emitted from the exhaust system. To learn more about how the DPF, catalytic converter, and other emission control devices work in your car, this video explains it in detail. You can check it out on our channel. Gray exhaust smoke is the rarest case of them all. However, it can be more challenging to diagnose. Because gray is a color that can be interpreted differently, seeing a cloud of smoke coming out of your exhaust in that shade can mean a lot of things. Let's take a look at some of the possible reasons why your car could be puffing out gray smoke. Another common reason could be a faulty PCV valve. You may not think much about it, but the PCV valve plays a key role in reducing vehicle emissions. It works by rerouting unburned fuel and gases from the engine back into the combustion chamber. Over time, though, the valve can wear out. When this happens, oil might start leaking into the intake manifold, and this can cause gray or bluish smoke. In diesel vehicles, gray smoke can be a sign of low oil levels or insufficient oil pressure. When there's not enough oil, the engine can run hotter, and this can cause incomplete combustion, leading to gray smoke being emitted from the exhaust. In summary, white smoke typically indicates coolant is leaking into the engine, often due to a blown head gasket. Blue smoke suggests oil is being burned, which could result from worn valve seals, piston rings, or a malfunctioning turbocharger. Black smoke signals that the engine is burning too much fuel, usually caused by a rich fuel mixture. Gray smoke may indicate the engine is burning both oil and fuel, or it could point to issues with the turbocharger. So that's it. If you've ever had excessive smoke coming from your car's exhaust, tell us about your experience in the comments. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more videos like these.